Hello, welcome back to Saturn's factory. Um, um, I'm looking into this direction on purpose. There's a reason behind it. I'm not turning around on purpose because I want him to get a genuine reaction out of this. Because what happened is we haven't gamed together for, it's been a bit more than a month. Um, I had an accident, I broke my foot and we I was out of commission for a while. And I just optimized everything. Yeah, there's building number one. Okay, is if, there stairways? Yeah, 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 exactly. If you go out front, this is what it was the back access. Come follow me out front. Each building also has signs of what is being produced in them. Where do you go? There you go. Uh, here, here is the front door. Here. If you come out here, you can see behind you there's signs of what's being built in each building. Oh, cool. And there is access stair. Uh, you can take this tube to the main hub here. What? If you take this tube, it will. Huh. It will bring you to the main hub. You did a little building, you said. Yes, a little, <laughs> a little building. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um, yeah. Is this is where we started with the. Yes, exactly. Here is that yellow. Yeah, this is the building over here that we started with the plates where we drove our carts in. And the jump that we had is still here. The original jump. It's just a little advanced now. Um, where are you? Yeah, exactly. Here, I put everything in the red circle. I'm uh, in the red area. I moved over, like the store, our cra crafting bench, and so on. The the resource bench. I moved it all over here. But this building over here is still the original building for the smart plate production. Okay. And this is still the jump that we did here. Oh, I see. There's the cliff there. Okay. And the concrete Holy is shit. still being produced in here, yeah. Holy shit, dude. Um, each building has stairways to the top with a tower on them. Yeah, that's did you the... Move, did you move the set, this thing at all? The hub, yeah, I moved it, uh, just squared it out. That's all. But otherwise okay. it's in the same place. Holy crap! Holy shit! <laughs> if you come over here, this is the highest building you can see from the top here. Oh yeah, everything, and everything is coming to this center street here, of storage. We have first plates and copper sheet and concrete and smart plate. I haven't, crap. I haven't gone further in the phases. Oh, you mean the vehicles? Yeah, and the road. <laughs> I haven't gone further in the phases and uh, developed further. Oh, there's a fucking what? <laughs> I just built. So I didn't progress the game. I just used what we had and made a factory for each of the things. Yeah, the road doesn't go far. <laughs> I was playing with the asphalt. Holy crap, dude. I was building a little, he says. Yes. Oh, I can meet you over there. I think I might be there quicker than you. I'm taking you over. Oh, yeah, 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 drag race. Oh, uh, yeah, I passed you. <laughs> Holy shit, man. That's the other island. Yeah, most of the areas are not accessible by cart. Oh, no. Exactly. <laughs> most of the areas are not accessible. They just, I built them just to. Bye bye. Oh cool, it writes itself. Yeah. This is cool, dude. Come. That's some amount of work. Yeah, come come back come back to the hub. Where's all the power stations? Yeah, exactly. That's what I'll show you next. Let's go up to the main yellow building first. Where are you? If you follow me through the storage street. This is insane. And if you take this tube here with the power sign. And as you see, you like sped up because I uh, abused the. You, you're gonna see in a second it goes foop, foop, foop. Because I, if you go uphill, it will slow you down and will okay. speed you up if you go downhill. But you can abuse the system by having multiple entrances, like right here. Da -da -da -dum. So this will bring you to the power fields. Oh, yeah, I see the booster thingy. 
That's a long distance, man. Holy crap. Holy crap. The power fields. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you went ah, back in. No. <laughs> turn around. You can turn around in the tube. <laughs> okay, good, good, good. I was hoping you could. Oh, it's loud here. These are the power fields. This is how much coal is down here. Uh, that's a couple of mines. Holy crap, dude. So I said the coal, that's one line of coal coming in, being split up to everything then, is it? Yeah. It's one miner per eight uh, plants. And three pumps. And we have headroom for the power. We have lots of headroom left because I didn't, like I said, I didn't um, progress. Yeah, you've just been, just been slapping all this down. Holy yeah. crap, how much time did you have? I had a broken foot. I had lots of time. Yes, yes, I remember, yes. <laughs> I, was, I was only expecting our area to be done up, but not as much as you've done it, but not all this as well. Follow me. Bum, 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 bum. And bum, bum, bum. Okay. <laughs> it goes, it's quicker to go back than go here. <laughs> I love these tubes. This is insane. Brr. Ooh, crash. <laughs> That's such a flying out game. But... <laughs> it's pet yard. Okay, follow me. Up here. And then up here. Here I made a mistake, but it's uncorrectable. Uh, I okay. These are off kilter, but it doesn't matter. You didn't align to the grid. I didn't align to the grid, yes. Let's go all the way to the top. Many and then, and then in here. And it goes up higher. Oh yeah, by the door, so you don't get confused. I put arrows as well, what leads where. And then up higher. And here's the tower. And from here you get a nice overview over... Our little factory. Holy crap. Yeah, each building does different things. They're all color coordinated, the buildings. Oh yeah, you can write that thing, by the way. This thing over here. The You can write the manta. Okay, yeah, manta's back. Sweet. You can pat them, you get an achievement. Oh yeah. For you, is a problem. You have to wait for it to come back around to the building to get off. I have a jetpack, so I'll... Ah, uh, here. <laughs> I see you then. <laughs> Ah, oh, at least I get a nice tour from the back of this. Yeah, it's gonna get go all the way around through the rock and then... What's up there, up that road that I failed to drive up? Oh, it's just material coming from there. It's just, I think, limestone or catrum. Something is coming from there. I forgot. But okay, yeah. Do you want to, while I'm flying around waiting to come back, do you want to move, move us on to end of phase two? <laughs> So yeah, we have one central storage aisle um, and we have color coordinated buildings. The white building is for the glass and stuff. Most of the buildings are also connected by bridges and catwalks. I try to keep it somewhat pretty. I stopped when I had a jetpack. <laughs> but yeah, I made the mistake, um, two mistakes. One mistake was that I didn't align two of the factories by grid, which then kind of... Does not matter. It no, it does not does, be perfect. It doesn't matter. It's like, I, I, would, I just went with it. And another thing is, I planned to have most of the belts underground and then have levels going above them. In some places I do, and in some places I don't, so it doesn't matter either. So I have the the wall of belts, <laughs> that I call it, coming in into the central storage. This there's is a, insane. There's a bit of a spaghetti above the storage because I didn't have them come in underground. I wanted to originally have all these belts underground and then have it with lifts into the boxes, but I just went with it. At some point I went too far and it's just like, okay, this is what it's going to be. Yeah. Oh, there you come. Yeah. Catch this! No? See, that's some amount of work. I can see you over there. 
Oh! <laughs> okay, when you come close to the building, you gotta get off again. Behind you. There's the balcony it lines up with. Yay, you made it. Ah, oh, get off his wing! Get off his wing! No! Uh, okay, bye bye. <laughs> oh, you made it to the top of a tower. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, that's gonna hurt. That was oh. cool. Yeah, you can. Oh, no, 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 no. No, there's stairs here in the front here. And it connects to the blue building as well. Okay, dude, that's some amount of work you did. Right, where's the... Uh... Oops. I have no idea where you are. <laughs> he lost in the factory. <laughs> uh, no, 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 I'm outside. I was looking for the area to flick the switch for the, the next... <laughs> okay, yeah. Um, we There's need... a drill here not working with iron ore on it. Yeah, it's probably because it's whatever pr it's supplying is done. Yeah, we have tier 4 to do. Uh, we can do the blueprints. Uh, the Mark 3 logistics. I was been waiting for that. Go for it. Pick whatever you want. No. I, see, I didn't progress because I thought... I'll, I'll wait. Let me just grab the yeah, material. Yeah, yeah. So we can just chuck through them now. Oh, wait. This was the wrong one. We have the steel bars here. We need how many? 200 I got. Reinforced plates we have over here. Iron bars I have 150 on me. No, we need a schnizzle. One, two, three, four reinforced plates. Finally, then I can upgrade the belts immediately. <laughs> I have not seen the rocket fly out from the location it is in now. <laughs> in a while, yeah. Not just in general, from in between these buildings. Milestone reached. Improved storage containers. Oh yeah, and, and there is a reason mark. why some of these blocks are red. For improving your current setup. Production speed is why? of essence after all. Because if so you get too close hard. to the tube, you're gonna get sucked in. Aha. Uh -huh. depending solely on the choices that you make, because they are. Warning. Fixit psychologists recommend not dwelling on the crushing mental and physical strain of your responsibilities and simply continuing to be productive. Nice. Hard work has repeatedly proven to be the best cure for any kind of stress. Now back to work. <laughs> now back to work. Now we can speed up production even more! <laughs> okay, but well, what's the next, the next thing then? Yeah, we have to wait for it to come back. Oh yeah. But yeah, we can go expanded power infrastructure, which is really cool because we can do power storage. And we can do the power towers, which is, they're like long distance powers. And then you can do really far zip lines. Oh, and we can set up another small production area somewhere else and transport everything back here. Yes. Yay! Whee! Okay, I now have a zip line. Whee! Okay, then I'm gonna fill up for the next milestone. There we go. Off it goes again. Milestone reached. After several pioneers started exhibiting traumatic responses to power blackouts, Fixit developed mitigation tools recommended by your local therapist. <laughs> power storages can hold excess power to delay or prevent blackouts in the eventuality that your factory's power consumption exceeds production. To simplify, these are rechargeable batteries. Power towers carry power lines for significantly greater distances than poles, facilitating factory expansion and exploitation of this environment for the good of Fixit and humanity. Cool. I also made a, uh, a production line for biofuel because okay. we, we need it for I need it for the jetpack and we need it for the cars and stuff. Uh, for now, because we don't have automated jet fuel production yet. But there's what, two. What, what do you make that out of? Uh, um, uh, we're not there yet. But here's two containers like we had before: one for wood and one for leaves. Okay. Just dump them in there whenever you have some. But they store over here. 
they produce in that building and then they store over here but we have we have a bit not much like we have a little bit is there what's this thing do it's a tractor it has a crafting bench on it yeah uh, the other thing, uh, thing also has a crafting bench on it It's a tractor, you can program it to pick up stuff and drop off stuff. You can make different stations for it. We don't have a jetpack for you. You gotta go explore. I found mine um, next to one of those crashed ships. It was just lying there. Did you bring power with you to open them? No, it was just lying next to it. Oh, oh yeah, if you look on the map, there's a bunch of stuff if you zoom in that I marked already. Sam and nitrogen gas. Yeah, I, I figured out you can make custom uh, waypoints. Yeah. Sam is that purple ore that we needed to research. And nitrogen gas is just because we probably need it later. Okay. And I marked all the radioactive sites as well that I came across. So let's see, what's next? Blueprints. Oh, perfect timing. Rocket just returned. Oh, one thing that I haven't done yet. Let's see. Um, now that you're here. Oh yeah, here's boxes with stuff that I found that we haven't researched yet. But one thing I haven't done yet is... Uh, split. Fix it sees what you did there. How creative. I have also been creative. There is something extra special for you in the awesome shop. It is a marvel of technology. It is truly the shape of the future. I will be sad if you do not use it and love it and tell any friends you make in the future <laughs> all about it. Use it and love it and tell all your friends about it. Ch check the first page in the awesome shop. <laughs> what I just unlocked. Specials. Check cyber wagon. <laughs> yeah, the cyber truck. <laughs> no way. There we go. Off we go. Bye bye, Rocky. New building. Milestone reached. Blueprints reduce repetitive building tasks, further optimizing your progression towards saving Earth with its beautiful ecosystems, abundant natural resources, resources and sunsets over thing. frolicking puppies and kittens. The blueprint designer allows you to Is build and combine structures once and yes. duplicate that configuration uh -huh. effortlessly. Any complaints about the spatial restrictions will only reveal your own inefficiencies. <laughs> <laughs> so we can make a blueprint station now, where we can make blueprints of buildings that we can copy and place. Ah, uh, you don't have to like the whole thing down, you can just copy and paste. Down. Yeah, but there is a restriction to the size of the blueprint, and that's what she just mentioned. Um, ah. Any restriction of the size uh, just shows your own inefficiency. Okay. Uh, quickly, I'm gonna build one of those now because I do have all the materials. You do that, I'm still trying to get the grips with everything, and like, I, I, it's not the same game I left. It is the same game you left, it's just that... Well, it's, it looks completely different. It's so organized and labeled and OCD and it's cool. <laughs> because I know who I'm playing with. <laughs> yes. <Yeah, sure. laughs> what is that? That's the blueprint station. Oh. Once you have built a satisfactory blueprint, interact with the blueprint designer terminal to save it. It will then be available in the blueprints tab of your build menu. Blueprints can always be edited to correct mistakes or optimize. If you find yourself struggling to work within the set size restrictions, remember that this is a you problem, and efficiency can always be improved. <laughs> as soon as you put that down there, I've been playing too much Subnautica. I was, about, I was looking for my scanner to scan this thing. <laughs> now we need to make a blueprint tool now, and then we can do blueprints and... But yeah, I just built it to be have it built. Oh, so you could basically make a blueprint of this entire complex, could you? Yeah. You I just make... go somewhere else, plunk it down, poof. Yeah, exactly. And hook add it up. Resources. Yeah, hook it up to resources. 
you can make there's some i've seen some people out there that did like really efficient production lines that fit into this and then they just plonk them down all over the world and then they transport them by train or drone later on we get drones and trains so that's something that's coming up